Hey everybody, Dr. Axe here, here to talk about one of my favorite topics, essential oils. And if you're just getting started with essential oils, I'm gonna talk about my Fab Five essential oils we should all be using on a regular basis. And all of, the, all of us should have these in our supplement cabinets. And myself and my wife, Dr. Chelsea, use these all the time. Number one essential oil is lavender oil. Lavender oil is the most widely consumed essential oil in North America, and it has loads and loads of benefits. Now, I tend to use this topically, as well as diffusing this, and this is great for relaxing and calming the body, and I love doing this right before I sleep in the evening, helping me wind down. But lavender oil, especially if you get a burn or a cut or a scrape, we put lavender oil on that area, and also we use it to help us relax. So lavender oil, the ultimate oil for relaxation. We also love using it in a bath with some Epsom salts, magnesium. Magnesium is the relaxation mineral. Uh, and doing about 20 drops of lavender oil in there, a great way to relax uh, there with lavender oil. Number two oil you should consider using is frankincense oil. Frankincense is probably the single oil that I personally use the most. I say when and down frankincense. Frankincense is great for supporting uh, really, I, I believe the entire body. I use this in the morning when I pray and meditate and really just start off my day. I'll take about three drops of frankincense on each hand. I'll sort of rub it on my temples and neck area. And then I'll spend time reading, personal growth, that sort of thing. But frankincense is an amazing oil that's been used for thousands of years. It's referenced more than 300 times in the Bible. It's referenced in Egyptian medicine. It's referenced in Ayurvedic medicine. It's referenced in lots and lots of different types of health protocols uh, all across the globe. So frankincense has big benefits. If you want to know all of the benefits, Google search Dr. Axe frankincense benefits, and I've written on it in the past as well. Uh, another favorite oil of mine is lemon oil. You know, lemon essential oil is very cleansing. Now, historically, in traditional Chinese herbalism, they would take orange peel or orange, uh, or lemon or orange peel oil, and they would put that in different products to really support and help, uh, help uh, a healthy lymphatic system. So that's how it's been used for thousands of years. But lemon oil is very fresh, it has a great scent. Uh, we'll use it actually even to clean our house. We'll mix that with uh, tea tree oil and vinegar and water and use it to clean the house. But again, lemon oil in general is very good. It's very soothing, it's very cleansing. There's one, it smells great. You wanna diffuse it? A lot of people, including certain hospitals I know, will diffuse citrus oils because it may support a healthy mood. Number four essential oil you should consider using is peppermint oil. Peppermint oil is very energizing and also is oftentimes used to support a healthy digestive system, okay? So peppermint oil, um, I love doing just a single drop in water. I also love adding it to a smoothie, like a dark chocolate smoothie. Chelsea has made peppermint patties with these. Now peppermint, we don't think these of having necessarily these big health benefits, but they actually do. They're also, also very energizing and may support focus. So you can diffuse this around the house. It's very uh, uplifting. So peppermint oil is a great oil to use in a lot of different ways. And the last oil, I love this oil for cleansing your house and it's tea tree oil. Tea tree oil is sourced out of Australia and tea tree uh, is great to actually combining cleaning products. It's great for, as combining with other products for natural, uh, naturally support healthy skin. So you can mix this with frankincense oil and lavender oil and your natural moisturizer at home, put it on your skin. Uh, there as well, and it can support your body. Uh, tea tree oil has been used for, again, a long period of time for helping with blemishes and breakouts there as well. Uh, but tea tree oil, again, it's just very cleansing. So if you wanna clean out your shower, it has antifungal properties. So tea tree oil is really amazing in that way as well. So again, uh, there's so many fantastic essential oils, but if there's five you've got to have on hand, these are the five you've got to have on hand. If you don't have them, make sure you get them right now. Chelsea and I, no matter what, uh, whether we're using them that day or not, we always have these stocked in our health supplement cabinet at home, and I know you guys are going to love these as well.